back in New York. The Chicago Bears have two first-round selections. Chicago Bears first-round selection, Brad Muster, running back Stanford. Brad Muster, a guy that the Bears never thought they would see this late. They have no real big blocking fullback. Muster is a back in a totally different area. He can do a lot of things that most big men can't dream of doing. If there's something medically wrong, then they've got a problem. But the pick could be a great one for him. He could be terrific. And what he offers them, he offers them another guy out of the backfield. You're talking about a guy, Brad Muster, who in 1985 caught 78 passes in one year. This guy is a fullback. And Joe, I have heard his name mentioned with, like a teammate of yours, John Riggins was. I don't want to compare him to Riggo yet because that's in a class of uh, by himself. But one personnel guy told me that no running back coming out of college in the last 20 years can run routes as well as Muster. A big guy that has shifty little moves and catches the ball. Tough thing when you got big guys that can move and have the ability to get around. It really, really puts a lot of pressure on a defense. It could bring another element of the Bears offense into play, and that's a, a fullback that can catch the football. Chicago, LSU's Wendell Davis, a wide receiver. Uh, talking about injuries, he had one as a sophomore back in 1985. Blossomed really is an outstanding wide receiver in the junior year, averaging about 15 yards a catch. Was the offensive co-MVP of the team. Outstanding hands and body control. Did not play well in one postseason game. That was the Japan Bowl. And doesn't have what you, I guess, would call great outside speed, what, about a 4-6. What really helped him, Bob, was in the last two weeks, week and a half, he ran a 4-4-8 and a 4-5-2 on the indoor track. And I think people then realized he's a little quicker as far as 40 time than people thought. You can see here his ability to catch the football and adjust to that poorly thrown ball. So there's no question the guy's a disciplined receiver. I gave him a 4-7 for getting open because he has that good quickness out of his cuts, even though his 40 speed still was kind of marginal. We got the Bears up. The Bears uh, took linebacker Dante Jones from Oklahoma. So in the first round, they had gone Muster and Davis, offensive players. Now the Bears go to the defensive side of the ball with their third pick in the top two rounds to Dante Jones.